we talked about the supernova and the Alpha 65. Let's finish this, shall we? Hello to all my fellow peeps, family, and space nerds. I appreciate all of you joining us in today's video review. So glad to have you here on the Brandon Nogi channel. Today we're covering, that's right guys, the latest flagship, the Supernova by Gravistar. I know you guys are very familiar with the company because I've done quite a few of their products. And we're also covering its little companion, the Alpha 65 Fast Charger. So yeah, I got both to cover today. This, my friends, finally completes my Gravistar wish list. As I am now the proud owner of their Pro Cyrus Gaming earbuds, the Cyrus P5 True Wireless earbuds, the Venus Mini Bluetooth speaker, their Mars Pro. Oh, have I been waiting and patiently waiting for this to arrive. And finally, the latest flagship, the Supernova and the Alpha 65. Gravistar, if you're watching today, I'd like to personally thank you for all the products that you have provided me in reviewing for my followers and fellow newbies. So what do you say we get started with all of what comes in the Supernova box? First things first, you're gonna get this user manual. It's, uh, it's very bland, if you will. It's only one page of English. The rest are in different uh, languages. Uh, will you need it? No, not after watching this video. I'm gonna show you how everything works. You're also getting a USB type A to a USB type C charging cable and also a 3.5 millimeter to a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable. Always nice to have the option. Also included in the box is what I'm calling a graveling hook looking hanger. And you also get an Allen wrench and three set screws. Very easy to assemble. Rotate your speaker until you find the bar that has the two threaded holes securely tighten both screws and yes they give you an extra one in case you're a sloppy assembly there you have it in all its glory gravistar sent over the war damaged yellow version and i'm always surprised when they send out a product because i never know what i'm getting the war damaged yellow is going to cost you a little bit more than their other colors that they provide each of these speakers are hand painted by their artists to give you the unique and stellar look of a ship that's been out in space fighting whatever war we could think of. So yes, guys, no model will look the same. Look at the scuff marks in detail and this burning 
ash on the tips of each foot. I, it, extremely impressive. Not to mention the weight of this. Now, when I first saw a few of the YouTubers doing reviews of the Supernova, I thought there was a lot more plastic involved than there was, but there's really not, including the handle, okay? This is also made out of that alloy aluminum along with these bars around it and the whole entire base below that. The only plastic really on this piece is this shroud. So yes, it definitely has that premium feel in the hands. A lot more weighted than I thought. And like my Mars Pro, this also has those tentacles that fold in and out to give it that alien spider. Like I said, all this bottom base is in their zinc alloy as well, along with each sidebar that runs up and down the clear tube. Really not sure how that would fare if a sharp object was to puncture uh, the plastic piece here. And that's mainly why these three metal bars surround it for not only an aesthetic look, but also protection from any falls it may take. On the top of the speaker is your power on and off button along with volume plus or minus and your three lighting modes that give you eight static RGB lighting. Oh. From white to red, orange, yellow, green, light blue, dark blue, and pink. You also have two other modes, a multicolor fade and what they're calling a camping light mode. That's right guys, not only is this a Bluetooth speaker, but it can also be a standalone lamp oh my as gosh. well. On the opposite side, the ass end, yeah, I said it, is your three inch full range speaker. And on the front is your 0.5 inch high frequency tweeter, giving you a total of 25 dynamic watts. Now it doesn't sound like a humongous amount. Of course, it's a smaller speaker than the bigger ones that I've done. Let me tell you, once I play this for you, your minds are gonna be blown. On this side is your USB type C charging port and your three and a half millimeter auxiliary input. The Supernova is also compatible with another Supernova, giving you true surround sound. Using their included handle, it will be super, no pun intended, easy to carry, transport, and set up on the go. Let's nerd out with me real quick. I wanna give you guys the exact specs and what you're getting in this super duper Nova. It is designed and engineered by International Master of Acoustics in the USA. With its unique triangular design, it will offer high quality crystal clear stereo sound for a truly immersive listening experience. Oh. Now, of course, that's their words, not mine, but you can count on a test later for your ears to decide. As far as battery life, according to Amazon, it says up to 28 hours of playtime. However, Gravistar's website says nine hours of playing time. Amazon considering like two of them connected together, are they combining the two? No, that doesn't add up, right? That's 18 hours. I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and go with Gravistar's nine hours saying that volume is maxed out and the lighting is being played the whole time. Also coming equipped with Bluetooth 5.3. Now they're saying it's a very fast connection, which it is, and you'll be able to step away from this a hundred feet. Hey Siri, what is a hundred feet in centimeters? 100 feet is 2,048 centimeters. For my Canadian friends. Now, being able to be away from the speaker itself is actually not a problem because you're only gonna be able to adjust the volume up and down and the play and pause, and of course your lights. You are not going to be able to forward a track or reverse a track on the actual speaker. It's all gonna have to be done on your mobile device, which is kind of unfortunate. And lastly, I looked all over the internet, could not find it anywhere on the box, the packing, the instructions, nowhere to be found is an IP rating. Now, it really troubles me because you basically see this dude dangling this thing off his backpack over a flowing river. 
So yeah, I would have to have an IPX7 or better for something like that. You definitely don't want that thing flying off and falling in the water. I guess it's safe to say, let's give it an IP4 rating like most water spray on it. it. Could be out in the rain a little bit, but you definitely don't want to give this thing the plunge. Let's take a look at the newly released Alpha 65. That's right, it's a fast wall charger GAN 65 watts. This is what they're calling the one-stop solution for efficient and versatile charging. Ooh. Ideal for charging multiple devices like my MacBook Pro Max, or your iPhone 14 Pro, or an S22 Ultra, any mobile device, any laptops, even the Nintendo Switch. Hell, I think anything that you throw at this little guy will certainly be able to take a charge. You'll have a three port design with their 18 watt USB-A port and a 20 watt USB type C and most importantly, the 65 watt fast port. Hooey! That, my friends, is gonna come in extremely clutch. You'll have the flip out AC wall plug that I love to be able to push that in and out of the way when you're not using the device. Oh, and by the way, yes, you will be able to order whatever juice you need, including of course the US, the UK, and Europe. Now, obviously they sent out the war damaged yellow as well. I'm guessing to keep the aesthetics matching nicely and boy does it but you can pick them up in two other colors that we'll go over in the retail segment. This is definitely a toy for people like me that are very childish. You can have a ball with this thing with playing with the antennas to pulling out the feet and making this thing sit up. Very fun, but also very, very useful in providing the juice to all your accessories that need it. All right, let's fire up the main attraction, which is the Gravistar Supernova. All right, who the hell's job was it to let me know that there was this little piece of styrofoam? I'm just now catching that. How about you? Best part about Gravistar, any model, they always have that stellar start up and shut down voice. Where they get this guy's voice is beyond me, but it is really kick-ass. You guys ready? Press and hold your power button. Ready to pair. Ready Bluetooth to pair. Connected. Bluetooth connected. I love that guy's voice. It's really cool. And then when you shut it off, it doesn't say anything, but it does this. Come on. That is very unique and definitely attention to detail. All right, before we test out some songs on this, I wanted to give you a quick brief explanation on what you can function. Obviously, power on, off, play and pause, volume up and down, you guys can figure that out pretty easy. As far as the light mode goes, pressing the mode button fast two times is going to change it into that multicolor that we talked about earlier. Pressing it twice again, is going to change it into single static colors. Now, pressing it once each time is going to change it from the color choices. And like I said, you get eight, so don't tell me you can't find that perfect color, which I'm pretty happy with dark blue. <laughs> pressing it two times once more is going to put you back into the lamp mode that we were in earlier. All right, let's test out some songs. And guys, I have four picked out for you today, and they are all gonna be provided by a royalty-free platform that I use quite frequently in a lot of my videos, and that is Artlist. If you're a content creator looking for that next song title, Artlist has a plethora of songs to choose from. Or how about those sound effects that you hear in all my videos? What about that perfect stock footage you've been looking for? Artlist and Artgrid have it all for your creative needs. I promise you guys, if you're on the fence of becoming a content creator like myself, look no further than Artlist. Check out all the details that I left down in my description below and be sure to grab yourself two free months on top of the one year subscription on me. You're welcome. Let's start out the first song called California Weekend by Alex Makes Music. You can already 
pretty, you feel the bass coming from the rear end. Wow. Let's turn it up. Again, no distortion either. I don't think we got to go any further with any more tests. I'm going to let you guys obviously choose your own genre. You're welcome. The proof is definitely in the pudding when it comes to anything made by Gravistar, of course, to be able to take this anywhere you want and play some really kick-ass music and, of course, make it a conversational piece because there will be people asking you, what the hell is that thing and where the hell can I get one? Let's cover my pros and cons and then get you guys out of here. We're gonna cover pros and cons only on the Supernova. I don't think there's any reason or need to do a pros and cons on the Alpha 65 because there's really nothing that compares to it. There's really nothing that's going to compete with it. That being said, pro number one, obviously, is the design and build. When it comes to anything built by Gravistar, you know you're going to get yourself something way the hell out in outer space. Pro number two, I'm actually gonna give it to the graveling hook. Yeah, I can't believe that I'm actually saying this because when I first saw the release of the Supernova, I didn't know what to think. I didn't really care for this hook. And I, again, I thought it was plastic, number one. Definitely not. But I'm adding this to the Pro because not only is it nice to carry around, which is very easy, but it's also a hook. So if you go camping, you can hang it on a branch. You can hang it on the back of your chair. It just sits there. And I'm telling you, they were definitely using their noggin when they came up with that idea. And of course, you get the lighting show and above all, the sound that you're going to get that comes out of the speaker. It is absolutely incredible. I was very blown away with the actual deep, rich sound that comes out of such a small speaker. Now, of course, where there are pros, there are always cons. I mean, after all, this is the Brandon Nogi channel and I always have something to bitch about. Con number one, because it doesn't come with an app, which most Bluetooth speakers don't, you're not able to forward a track or reverse a track on the actual speaker. And I think that is a con because you might be next to your speaker, but not right next to your phone or the device that you have connected to it. So that can kind of be an inconvenience. Con number two, they didn't give us an IP rating. So I'm not sure if it is actual con or pro. If it was an IPX6 or 7, then that would make it to the pro list. However, if it's an IP4 rating, making this an outside speaker could be dangerous when it comes to water. And the last con, it's a little pricey, which we're gonna cover the retail right now. Now, of course, I am not sponsored or endorsed through Gravistar, okay? They have sent me these wonderful products for me to review for you and give my honest opinion. That's it. I will be providing you an Amazon affiliate link down in my description below. Yes, I get a kickback. It's not ginormous, but it definitely helps me and the channel grow in making you these awesome videos. Also keep in mind, I will be providing you the Gravistar website as well. So we're gonna have a couple different prices. The Supernova in the war damaged yellow, 
On the Gravistar site, retails for $229.95, selling it for $195.45, okay? But you can also pick out matte black that normally goes for $179.95, on sale for $152.95, as well as their Dawn White. Now, as far as Amazon goes, I was only able to find the black color, which they're selling for $152.96 after an instant 15% off coupon. So if you guys don't mind the color black, you don't need the war damaged yellow, it's a no-brainer. Now let's talk about the Alpha 65. The War Damage Yellow on Gravistar's website retails for $59.95. No discounts, no coupons. You also get the choice of War Damaged Blaze Blue. Ooh, why did they send me that one? Oh, that's right, because I don't have a supernova to match. That one goes for $59.95 also, but you can pick up Dawn White for $49.95. So if you don't mind white, again, it's a no-brainer. Let's talk about Brannon's affiliate Amazon sales. The Dawn White is also $49.99, but you get a clickable 15% off, making it $42.50. Now we're onto something. However, if you're feeling fancy and you want the War Damage Yellow, it's also $59.99, but you get a clickable 10% coupon at checkout making it $54. Definitely a no-brainer on where you will obviously go to pick up your items, but be observant with the Gravistar link. Don't let them fool you. They have dropped their prices, which they just did before this video releases today. Let's open a fortune cookie and get you guys on your merry way. All right. The... <laughs> The fortune word of the day is his. What? His, hers, I think they're trying to say something. Uh, great acts of kindness will befall you in the coming months. I sure the hell hope so. Well guys, this concludes our video today. If you have hung with me this long in this review, you're either family or there could be Crazy. a little something wrong with you. But hey, you guys know as well as I do, we will not, will not judge at this table. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe on your way out that door if you are not already. I'll be seeing you in my next video.